It's about one o'clock when Melissa emerged with two bags from her house and heads to the road to catch a bus. Land so rich and green, it's people strong and glad. Just to live right here, have a share in Tobago or Trinidad, racial harmony. As she sits down and settles, she begins to think. Why growing up in half my culture? Tobago country girl? No TV with good reception? Just radio with even worse reception? Never knew the color or flavor of my blood. Because I was half developed. Until almost 21. I decided to go to Trinidad. Beautiful people you could never meet. With no real expectation of what I was going to do when I get there. But searching for something. Something that I was missing. My other half. Another world unexplored. Another culture to experience. Tobago, goodbye. Trinidad, here I come. It's amazing how Trinidad and Tobago is one nation, but yet still separated by water. I cannot wait till I get to Trinidad. This is so exciting. Tobago is my home. Don't get me wrong. It just is the Trinity song. Anyway, that's why the Paradise Concepts applies. Because I am integrating them both and becoming a TNT prejudice. I am a bagel girl who is going to explore Trinidad to experience the rest of my country's culture and people. River Lime, Curry Duck. This atmosphere is so different to back home. All the hustle and the bus of cars and lights. Crab and Kalaloo. Topi Tambu Cascadu. Tolo, Benny Ball. Can't leave out from City at all. Mommy Apple and Quadu. Damn, oh my god, who is that cute boy? Whoa! Now, do one get jealous to the girls? I'm not here to tackle your man, you know. Well, okay, just that one. I just call it character building. And, well, I am trying to spread my wing. Talking about wing, I hear about training doubles, boy. I wonder if I could get one. Mm, this tastes good, boy. But does not compare to Tobago, bacon, saltfish. It's a right. Bukuri. Hmm. It's getting late. Time to go and rest my head by the only fan I have in Trinidad, Lisa. My first party in Trinidad. Wow, this is so exciting. Despite my speech clarifies my identity, my aruna, my rhythm, my collage, as reference of who I am, where I am from, is permanently cloaked under my skin as my essence of being Trinbagonian my birth and growth in my twin island my individualism and self-awareness from my mama bago my culture enlightenment and creativity from my papa trinidad a lot of diversity this parenthood is quite a match and here i am with a voice not to sing or to act but to say i am now a true Trinbagonian. Tobago sweet, 